The name communication and media arts really reflects uh, embracing new technologies. It reflects media the way they are used by businesses and by individuals today, uh, while retaining all the values of classic journalism and mass communication education as well. I think in our program, because it's at a small university, that you're going to be able to have the kind of, as I said before, the versatility and the generalization where you have knowledge about all the different areas that are required in media today. Visual communication, rhetoric, uh, presentation, um, technology, graphics, uh, writing, that kind of thing are all going to be a part of what you learn in terms of skills. And then along with that, you're going to have the ethics information that you need to become a responsible citizen. And also, when we think about media, we oftentimes we think of them as being in a detrimental way. We think of media as the bad people or the bad guys. And our program really promotes the idea that the power that you have as a media professional, a creative professional, allows you to actually change the world. In the public relations advertising journalism area, you understand the different audiences, you understand the different ways they need to receive their communication, and you're able to adapt your story, your communication, to each of the different formats of the media, whether it's online, whether it's an ink on paper newspaper, or a press release. Our media art students are very well versed in producing 2D animations, shooting still photography, shooting and editing video, they serve in capacities after graduation as producers, directors, camera operators, audio engineers, electronic graphic artists. Uh, at WCSF here at the University of St. Francis, uh, we use digital editing, we have state-of-the-art automation equipment, uh, and we have a studio that is exactly like the kind of studio that students who want to work in radio in the future uh, are going to be working in. So we have a, a state-of-the-art multimedia lab um, with a series of uh, stations that incorporate, we use Mac stations, but we also have uh, Windows capabilities. We have all of the Adobe Suite, we have all of the um, programs that are required to produce animation and multimedia and video editing and writing and static graphic design, print graphics. Um, so we have all of the applications that are required, plus the space is really nice because it allows students to work in a studio environment where there's enough space for them to work with each other and there's also enough space for them to work individually. Our uh, Encounter Writing Lab, as I call it, it's a, a setup of uh, five different iMac computers that students use not only to write stories on but also to do photo illustrations, to touch up their photography. Um, it's comfy, it's cozy, um, but it really is conducive to putting out the kind of work that uh, we get out on a daily, weekly, and monthly basis. Basically they can do everything from producing, to directing, to video switch, to edit, to post things on the web. Basically the overall conceptual conveying of an idea, regardless of format. Students will walk away with a, a variety of skills that will help them tell stories. I think a communication and media arts major primarily would be best for students who um, are interested in telling stories and basically telling their stories. And it's a very flexible major, so no matter what institution or company that you want to work in when you get out into the profession, um, you can work as a communication specialist because they all need that. All these organizations will need someone who's an expert in communication. Our media arts students not only know how to convey their message in a digital format, but they also understand the theory behind the things that they're trying to convey in their digital stories. They not only understand the software, but they also understand why they're communicating and how the way that they communicate will impact the message for the audience. Students should choose a communication and media arts major if they're interested in storytelling, 
if they are interested in communicating all kinds of information to all sorts of people out there through all kinds of different media. Digital media are here and they surround us and we work with both traditional and digital styles of production and uh, idea creation here at the University of St. Francis.